Hey guys, I'm back with another video. I know you guys miss me. I miss you guys. Oh my god, yes. Uh, so I just had my hair in box braids and I decided to do something spontaneous as soon as I took them out. So what I'm doing is I'm going in with a dark and lovely luminous blonde 396. This is the cream developer and yes, I am dyeing my hair. This is the, uh, basically it's like a fade resistant, um, color lifter. It's just like, that's basically the color that I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to shake this up and mix it with the developer really well, like extremely well. And be careful with the developer. You don't want to get that on your hands because you might burn your hands. Um, you don't want to get it. If you're going to do your hair closer to your skin, uh, make sure you put Vaseline so you don't burn your skin. Now, with this high lift booster, you want to make sure you're far away from it and you don't want to put your face closed because it's a powder and you don't want to breathe in that powder. As you see, I'm backing up. I'm like, nah, I'm not with it. I'm not with it. Mm -mm. So, yeah, you want to get all of that in there because that's what's going to lift your hair. So, you see how dark my hair is? It's going to help lift it. So, I did my hair on dirty hair because I needed my natural hair oils to protect my hair. Uh, while I'm dyeing it and they say it's just better because clean hair is just like too slippery and it doesn't the color doesn't penetrate the hair as it should so yeah dirty hair it is I didn't even brush it out right this is straight after the box braids and um, I'm just applying the color to my tips and you don't want to apply it like half of your hair unless that's the style you want I was more so like going to towards the middle of the strand and just dragging it down but mainly making sure that the product is at the tips of my hair because I want the tips of my hair to have the color. I don't want my whole head to have color so I'm just basically like dragging the dye from the middle down because I want like that fade where it's like going from dark brown to like light brown to like blonde. and. <clears throat> As you can see, like I'm adding more at the tips here, and then it's like a little bit in the middle, and then more so at the end. So that's just me. That's how I wanted to do it. Uh, you might want to, I didn't put a cap on, but you might want to put a cap on so that you don't burn your neck or anything. As you can see, my, my shirt was uh, getting crazy. Like, it was damaged, but... My hair wasn't really bothering my neck, but it might to some others. So you might want to put a plastic cap on while you're dyeing your hair. Yeah. My shirt is like bleached. It's ruined. But whatever. The color is taking really nicely. And, you know, I left it on for exactly 20 minutes. I didn't go overboard. When you go overboard, that's when you fry your hair. And make sure you wear gloves when you're doing all this. Because, uh, you, like I said, you can burn your hands. So this is my hair fully washed with the No Poo Decadence and the One Condition Decadence from Diva Curl. This is my Diva Towel. I love it. It's a microfiber towel and it's like so soft. So I'm going with the Deep Sea Repair Mask. And let me tell you, I, didn't, I was going to use the conditioner that the Dark and Lovely box came with. But I was like, you know what, I might as well deep condition my hair. Because I feel like if you deep condition your hair with color, like you're you'll be all right like you just have to really s maintain your hair and stick stick with the like your regimens and stuff so this deep conditioner was like bomb for me i did have a cup like a little bit of shedding but it was all right all right i expected it because you know i just had box braids and and you know i just dyed my hair so i added the towel because the the towel can create some heat so this is my hair washed out from the mask and it's like super bouncy and super soft. And I'm going to go with the super cream. <laughs> I'm going to go with the super cream and just apply it on my hair. I find that my hair gets more volume when I just do like uh, halves and not sections. So I'm going to add some light defining gel. I love this gel. It's so bomb. Like literally bomb. So I'm just going to rub that in. It says to scrunch it in, but I find it, it works better for me when I just run it through my hairs. My hairs. <laughs> run it through my hair. So I diffuse with my Diva diffuser, and I put it on a low heat just for a little bit. And then cool. 
and look at my results they is bomb y'all bomb.com i'm loving the color like i said just don't overdo it if it says 20 minutes 30 minutes just stick with the minutes that it's supposed to be and you'll be all right you're you can dye your hair and still have healthy hair you know so um don't be afraid to to do something different with your hair and that was my biggest problem like I was worried about what everybody else was gonna think and I was like you know what I'm just gonna do my thing I know what I'm doing so but if you guys like this video please put a thumbs up if you um not subscribed please hit that subscribe button and if you have any questions for me please comment below I am so excited to be back thank you guys for watching this video I'm out